Good morning. I am going to read a book for you today. I want to thank Mo Willems for letting us read his lovely pigeon books online for students who are at home, learning at home during this time. And I'm going to read Don't Let the Pigeon Stay Up Late. Oh, good. It's you. Listen, it's getting late. I need to brush my teeth. Can you do me a favor? Thanks. First of all, I'm not even tired, said the pigeon. In fact, I'm in the mood for a hot dog party. What do you say? No. <sighs> I hear there's a good show about birds on TV tonight. Should be very educational. How about five more minutes? Come on, what's five minutes in the grand scheme of things? <sighs> what? What? I'm not tired. You know, we never get to talk anymore. Tell me about your day. Oh, I've got a great idea. We could count the stars. Can I have a glass of water? Studies show that pigeons hardly need any sleep at all. It's the middle of the day in China. I'll go to bed early tomorrow night instead. Hey, hey, ho, ho. This here pigeon just won't go. Please. You can't say no to a bunny, can you? My bunny wants to stay up too. Okay, that was not a yawn. I was stretching. I'm a hundred and ten percent awake. You haven't heard the oh, last of me. Great work. Thanks. Good night. He's dreaming of a hot dog party. <laughs> the end. Thanks for taking a few moments to read with me today. I'm going to try and set up a new book for tomorrow. Goodbye.